Welcome, people. All right, I got a delay on it, so that'll be nice. Will do. So no uh, one can cheat. Uh, well, <laughs> we'll try to stop well. stop that from happening. As well. <laughs> As well. Yeah. There you go. <clears throat> Excellent. Lobby is full. What do you think about these uh, names, these player names here? I, I personally, I'm all for the Musket Enjoyer. I, that's that's a pretty pretty sweet name. Kuma Pants is also rather fun. They are excellent. Yes. So far, Musket Enjoyer has not been a sieve that has used European <laughs> units, so they haven't even had been able to get Musketeers yet. <laughs> Oh, oh, the Musk Enjoyer player? Yes. Mm -hmm. We'll see if France uses them. Yeah. All right, welcome, everyone. We are alive and kicking. It is the 2023 FFA Tourney F Grand Finals. We have six players here. Uh, four have won their group, and two were uh, voted in for their performance, for lack of words. Uh, I am tuned in here today with uh, the Claymore, who is going to be tuning in and giving us some excellent commentary. He wasn't able to play, uh, and he's been busting out some videos on his YouTube channel, so he's going to join us today. Welcome, sir. Hello, hello. I'm glad I could make it. Very excited. It, it helps tremendously to have a co-commentator. Um, because then I don't want to pass out and die after a five-hour game where I'm just talking <laughs> for five hours. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. There was one time where I forgot to turn on the recording button, and the game was like four hours, so I had to do it again. Oh, no. That is... I need to go find that video. <laughs> <laughs> I tried oh, as hard as possible to make sure no one knew that I actually saw everything that happened, so... <laughs> That's extremely rough. All right. I, I, What's up? Well, I, I had that a couple times with Streamlabs, but it definitely was not a four-hour video that I've done that took that that happened. But yeah, gotta learn, <laughs> gotta learn. And then and then I was like, oh, we can live stream these. That's helpful. You know, it's recording then. All right, so here we go. We're jumping into this. We have a slightly customized Great Lakes Finals map from Danzel himself. Uh, how should I go about explaining the adjustments here? I feel like maybe just lots of resources. I'm going to just put it in the chat. I'm just going to put it in the chat. Darn you. Google. All right, tell me when it's loading in. If they do it. All right, so in the chat, I'm putting. All the changes. For the map. <clears throat> Are you ready? Hopefully, wow, that's a, three British players. Many Brits. We have Brits in France galore today. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Why? I'm. I am shocked that there are no ports. I'm shocked that there's no Germany. There are Germans. Well, there is water, so it is less less uh, appealing. Sure. But I totally agree. I feel like with tons of resources, though, I don't know. I feel like that's kind of settler wagon's place. May your wrists not cramp. <laughs> that's amazing. Um, all right, so we will uh, announce who these players are after the game. I was, I have not prepared for that, so I will have to manually go back and look at these 
uh, things I wrote down. I will make a document. Um, but the four finalists who won are in this. They also have different accounts. So once again, no one knows who anyone is. Uh, I don't even remember who anyone is, so that's fun. Um, and then two players were advanced <laughs> for their excellent performances, uh, to say the least. So, <clears throat> all right, let me make sure player eight here is okay. Let me check the Discord. John Cordisco kicks us off. Oh, Russia has been chosen. All right, he's oh. going to change. Uh, That's exciting. John Cordisco kicks us. Hey, Sam, sorry, can't stay. Have an appointment. Good luck and have a great game. Well, you're going to have to watch this one again, John. So I guess I'll accept your forgiveness with that $5. Appreciate you. All right, so Russia does exist, so we do have a little more spice. I, there are going to be more Musketeers on this map in this finals than anything else <laughs> I've ever seen. I am a sucker for Musketeers, so I will not hate this yet. All right, here we go. We got to get this right. Oh, we got four. <laughs> I, I d oh. don't do anything. I individually selected your guys. This should work. Uh, Mark, because I enjoy Legacy. There's the answer. All right, we have... I love how it's a three coyote charger. Can we get any weaker of... Uh, units? All right. Yeah, that worked pretty well. That worked pretty, pretty well. well. You're just gonna one shot. Watch. It. Oh no. <laughs> no. 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 Oh gosh. That is... <laughs> Wait, is the island always this big? Oh. No, okay. it was made slightly bigger. Yeah. All right, this is gonna take me here. Uh, Danzel wanted to spice up our. Uh, Odds to give people 15,000 XP. <laughs> so thanks, Danzel. I also love the sound effect when they die. Oh, like, the, isn't it sound like a rainbow dying? It, know, is that what it is? It reminds me of Galaga. Like the arcade game. Oh, I haven't, I've never played that, so I don't know. Oh, that that's an essential. Oh, he almost swung. Oh my goodness, don't swing. The delay yes. is big. I think that he the is this cyan or teal? What do we call them? Cyan? I don't know. Yeah. He was having some uh, connection <laughs> issues, I think. This is ridiculous. This is gonna take nine years. It's three wait, two hit points per hit. <laughs> Do you see this? Oh, yes, ninety percent hand attack resist. <laughs> Literally gonna take forever. We're almost there. We're we're inching down. Actually, it's it's one. It's turning into one per one. one. Oh, uh, we're just gonna give people XP. Good luck. Oh. Everyone just got free I shipment. I feel like the game froze there for a second when that happened. <laughs> Let's see if anyone notices it. Five shipments. <laughs> I love it. Oh spice. We're adding spice. We're adding spice. Go let's see if they. Let's see what happens. I can't wait. All right, we just we just in <laughs> we just infuse this game with five shipments. Uh, we, There's we, no one that can hate that. We'll just blame Danzel. And we're just gonna blame Danzel, and also. We uh, put a one, a one uh, wolf treasure on the island now. That is, yeah. At least it's not a very good treasure, anyway. <laughs> they, oh, the... <laughs> we can't type. Uh, Figure it out, people. Figure it out. Should we pause and ask? I love seeing people <laughs> process things through a text chat. Yes. This is. <laughs> So chaotic. <laughs> uh. All right, this is hilarious. Welcome to the 2023 finals.
One thing I do like is just it looks like treaty players in here. <laughs> with how like smashed the at least some of them the buildings are smashed up right against the other. Yes. Uh-huh. Okay, okay. Mark. <clears throat> Say that again. Uh, it just looks like we got at least a few treaty players because they have like their markets and that's right against their town center. All right, yeah. Let's uh let's view around here. So lighting has changed. Um, natives are Huron, which is essential for the water upgrades. Well, there is a good fishing upgrade, but I think the Huron are one of the best natives in FFA because you get that extra siege. Um, so you can have a full army and not have to worry about units for siege, which is pretty nice. Or you can have your full attack concentrated in one area and then just send 20 Huron mantlets somewhere else. I, I hope one of the French players has like a bunch of oh. upgrades. Now that would be fun. That would be fun. It could see some very tanky natives. That's amazing. All right, an amazing start to the game is is the chat right now. Okay, other uh, changes to the map. Uh, forests are increased in size. Much neat. That was the biggest change that we wanted to make. The forests are larger because there is very little wood here. Uh, the center here is increased, obviously, so we could get a little more action here in the middle. Uh, more fish also. 40% fish increase, so we could see a lot more water action. Um, anything else? Uh, sheep herds have changed size too. So that's about it. And lighting is epic. What are your thoughts yeah, on the map did, changes? Did you, did you darken the lights? Is that it's, what that was? It's a uh, golden hour now. Yes. Uh, it's very nice. I Wait. do like a bigger middle island. That's, I feel like you can see some really fun stuff coming from that. Yeah. I'm... I'm watching for green. It looks like he's going full water. Okay, yeah, let's water. let's look. Let's go around. Well, I always start in the north. I always like starting in the north. So let's go uh, Santa Pug here in orange. If you go uh, menu player summary, yeah, you can click yeah. on the uh, flag. Yeah. So here we go. Brits. Lots of Brits today. We have the 25 infinite Cherokee and the two infinite rockets, which are excellent. Um, lots of late game power there. Obviously, a state's in there too. Uh, decide not to go with any cavalry cards, H2. Went full on with the infantry focus, other than cav train time. Um, yeah, other than that seems pretty standard Brit. I do, I do like the, the Virginia company. I'm hope, hopefully he does a nice, nice standard boom. Yeah, I get... No, no three bills. <laughs> Just straight Virginia company. No three bills. For the longest time I've had in my FFA deck, three vills because i forget to change it <laughs> and then every every time i get in the game I'm like well i have three villagers the only time i really can send it that's helpful is now <laughs> so virginia company will be helpful for him um all right yeah, go ahead wood, wood trickle as well so he's he's looks like he's going full in on wood yeah i gotta i mean you know the brit life Woods needed. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, longbows. I totally forgot. Yeah, they cost. They that. cost wood. Yes. Yes. Yeah, that's that's gonna be a lot. <laughs> Difficult. All right. So moving on to the east, uh, in the color teal, Deccan elephant. Immediately, my eyes drawn to thirty Nuka allies. I absolutely love it. Uh, just gotta love some clubmen out on the battlefield. Unicorn Mortars is here. Uh, infinite Gold as well. Kind of interesting. Yeah, that was... I would like to have seen, seen the Wood Trickle, but, you know... 300 coins not that bad. Yeah. We'll see. That's kind of... I'm, I'm, in, I'm just interested to understand why he did coins of Wood, but... We'll find out. Maybe he's just going to get have, that many cannons. He will have instant, instant infantry. He also has the Reformist Czar, the church card. So we might see some Baskar ponies. That's a good call. Yeah, I got the Baskar ponies and uh, dragoons. I wonder, do, do Nuka allies, I guess they'll get affected by the Ransack card. So they might have some very good siege. 
That's a great thought. I didn't never thought about that. Yeah. Oh man, can I? I wonder if the mantlets get that too. That could be devastating. Russia here <laughs> looks like that could be devastating. Who would have yeah, thought? That, that could hurt. That could really hurt. All right. Meanwhile, looking south, we have the biggest water boom of all time. Seven minutes in the game, I see already fifty fishing boats. It seems like. That Goodness. Ah, uh, we can't grab them. Uh. Playing with blue llama OP. I love how the Aztec player has received uh, the llama OP. Uh, username there, Arakania, shout out. I'm going to absolutely abuse these ultra cheap 15 wood fishing boats. Because. Right, double schooners. That makes sense. <clears throat> and he had a nice five shipment boost there, so. <laughs> Yeah, I would have honestly probably would have sent in all three wood cards and these two schooners cards immediately. <laughs> three wood upgrades. That's, that's a crazy. I, there's no coin in the water, is there? No. No, no coin. So it will so it he, will tap out at some point. Yeah. He he might. I hope he doesn't overinvest. I really want to see some great Inca, uh, Aztec play. Yeah, love Aztec. Love Aztec in the finals. We've had some great Aztec play in this tourney. That's what happens when you delete ports overpoweredness. Other civs can exist. He has the silent strike, the, the coyote runner invis card. I've, I don't oh, think I've nice. ever seen someone use that. Today's the day. FFA finals. That's today that's is the day. Great. That is great. All right. Continuing west in the color green is third amendment more brits action here <laughs> two monitors baby I, I do i do like just how like well-rounded this deck is but no infinite shipments yeah no so infinite shipments it's a little um, bit scary it is a little bit scary i we'll, we'll see schooner. yeah he yeah does have schooner so I, I, I'm hoping to see some clash on the water here. Oh, I people, think we definitely people, will. People hate on water fights, but I, I I think the exploding ships are pretty fun. Yeah, I don't get how people can hate on water fights. Unless you're facing China and you just get rushed <laughs> with fire junks, then you don't have any, is, any complaining. That is rough. Uh, also noteworthy, he has already sent a villager on the center island, has an outpost and dock there, so I like that. That's exciting. All right, continuing westward, we have Puma Pants 2. Already has the Black Watch out and two Falconets. Um, let's check his deck. Oh, never mind. He has the Highlanders. He probably didn't send Black Watch yet. Well, he does have the Glorious Revolution. He so does. He could have guessed done either. Maybe he's waiting to stack them. That would be incredibly exciting. Love to see Where? some kilts in action. <clears throat> also, he has the five privateer armada shipment age four. That's tremendous. Does uh, it, isn't it Dutch who gets an infinite privateer card? I think they do. That sounds like it should be true. I don't know if it is though. Uh, I trust you. I think this. I think this was the church card because I only see eight Highlanders here. Um, the shipment is nine. That's great. That All right, well, no water for him. Lots of sheep, though. And going north to our last player to be introduced here, Musket Enjoyer. Finally, we have someone who is European Civ using the Musket Enjoyer account. Unfortunately, it's France, so we might still not see any muskets. But we'll see. Cursors are banned, aren't they? Yes, they are banned, yes. Mm -hmm. uh, I love the image of the Northwest Passage card. It is the good. funniest image of any card. Because that bear doesn't... They should have made the bear look like he's attacking a little more. Just look like this bear's posing. And then this explorer's just like... <laughs> It just looks really weird. I don't know. It's kind of funny. I don't think I've seen anyone use Northwest Passage for actually for getting treasures. I've only oh, seen exactly. Yeah. Which 
I mean, I, I enjoy a good speedy bill, but... I want to know what the developers were thinking. They were thinking, let's make a card where the villagers can get treasures. And someone's like, okay, yeah, that's a good idea. But that seems kind of lame. Like, they need more incentive. Okay, what if they just got faster, too? All right, great, let's do that. <laughs> I love it. I am... Um, he does have the... He's got team, uh, or two Falks and the five Dragoons. He has five. Musketeers! You're right. He might he might send that in. Oh, they're yeah, in. Those two Falks are in. Falks. <clears throat> Exciting. Told, it looks like Red wants to push him over. Oh, yes, the flank! All right. Let's I get it, boys. I don't know who wins this. Oh, it looks like he did, he did the Black Watch and yep. he did the Highlander. So that's that's a pretty nice mask there. Uh, they're basically if you look at the hit points, they're basically double musk. They're over double musk. So yeah, especially the ranged attack is insane. That's basically fifty musketeers. Right there, very deceiving. That's I, I'm kind of worried for yellow, but he is walking way around. Yeah, he's. I'm not they're, quite sure. <clears throat> they're used to marching in the highland, man. Yellow has just like four random sheep over here between blue and cyan. Yeah, I saw it earlier and uh, was actually terrified that someone was across the map. <laughs> oh, he deleted them. They're now dead. They're now dead. All right. The walls are down within I'm, seconds. I am very worried for, for yellow here. These Highlanders, even even though they're heavy, even though the skirm should counter them, that's he doesn't have enough. I don't think. Uh, he has the two Falk, so it, if he can get the Falk play right, he will be successful. But it depends here. I bet Rev was very surprised to see uh, three town centers <laughs> on top here. I, I kind of want to see triple minute then out here. Oh, that's that, that, that is great, great call. Ooh, he did get a Falk. That is huge. They both traded one. Like... And oh. the second red falc is down. And the skirms in the back are doing big time out. damage there, so. Clear out. That was a good try. If he had like, I think if, if red had had five cab or something, he probably could have won that. But that was very, very good mic mi micro? Very good micro with the cannon yeah, yeah. from yellow. It worked out. Uh, meanwhile, uh, green and blue are getting some melee action on. Uh, <laughs> green has an absolute buttload of cavalry, and this... blue has a lot of anti-cavalry. This this green player is reminding me of that uh, green player we saw a few games ago, or was that game three? I think. Very reminisce, huh? Yeah, except this time they're gonna get wiped. He is just straight up trading with goodness. All right, he's not he's not afraid to use these cavalry. They are they did upgrade H four, so that's yeah. helpful. I did see that that uh, Aztecs did have the H four JPK upgrade, so those might actually come in very handy against the British. It's the musketeers in hand. Yeah, you're right. Mm -hmm. I do see a factory on the middle island, though. That is so scary. <laughs> Especially since Blue is absolutely demolishing him on the water. I'm guessing that factory is going to go Oh, they, the full-out naval war has begun. Canoes for days. Oh, that's that's hilarious. And, all right. Uh, deployed a... What do we call that? Man of War frigate? I don't remember what it's called. Uh, whatever. It's either. I uh, he's definitely gonna lose that. And the, the only thing that might save his factory is these three outposts, but I'm not sure if these will outrange those and be able to hit the factory. The yeah, that'll be interesting. Uh, but he is winning the land war. Blue or, or green is so. Winning the land war, losing the sea war. Said no British person ever. But here we go. It's happening. <laughs> Two monitors spawned in. Oh, this is great. Wait, how? I mean, the monitors do have good area attack, so that might might do well against the the, the, the light, like little hit point news. 
Yeah. <clears throat> okay, they're, they're Pumas coming out over here and Ergs. Yeah. So he's switching from JPKs. Fascinating. Looks like Green might have raided some bills over in the back to stop this wall from being built. All right. Pierce Green has won the water now. Yeah. No, it, yeah. <laughs> All right. That cav mass is fat and it is moving. Full investment into the cavalry. Zero chill for Green. <laughs> Uh, the known unknowns asks, "Hey Sam, will the tourneys continue for upcoming years, even after you retire?" I don't know yet. We'll find out next year. So it looks like Blue's having a hard time pushing out the units. Okay, here we go. Do you have some Puma now? Yeah, I mean, fifteen times five—that's they should be able to handle these. Except Puma are so squishy. That is that is a little bit troublesome at such high HP. I can't wait to see this engagement. I, I just love the ignorance of a cavalry player going straight into pike sometimes. <laughs> oh yeah, it's depending on which one you are. It's, yep. It's amazing how well it can work. Does does Blue have the uh, town dance? He does, but I don't know. I don't think he has that like, going. <clears throat> Here they go, Pokey boys. Cavalry having a hard time getting uh, good engagements. Yeah, the definitely. Choke point is really working well for. Him. Definitely favorable for Puma right now. Eagle Runners but, in the back being helpful. Unlike now, now it looks like Blue's gonna be winning the land and green the water. Yeah, vice versa. So kind of switching over. Green right. does have a lot better score though. So. Yeah, I think he's gonna probably come on top of here. That is shocking compared to, or considering the water eco that Blue has had. I guess Green's had a good one too, but you can see the amount of fish that are already gone by Green's water, or sorry, Blue's water close to the shore. Yeah. All right, meanwhile, other side of the map, oh, Orange. Oh. <laughs> oh, straight cannon and musk. That is the combo. Poor oh. Yellow getting picked on. We have a priest. Two priests! All right, MVP vote right now. Yellow is up. Musketeers and priests for friends. That's great. He does have that one Falk left, but I doubt against the Rockets, I don't think he'll be able to use that. Yeah, he'd have to win that micro. It is fully health at full health now because of the, uh, the priest. priest. Yeah. That's actually, that honestly, what is the priest? How much does it cost? Like, 100 coin. 100 coin to save a 400 coin unit is not, not a bad choice. Yeah, but agrees every no Ottoman coin. player ever. Sadly, no coin. That is for no uh, coins. But the Hussar did just pop. The priests are leading the charge. They're getting some melee on that Falk. Go! <laughs> now they're healing in the middle of battle. Oh my goodness. I do like the trades Yellow is taking. Yeah, he's got the cavern there now too. I do, I do like this play. Meanwhile, it looks like Blue is pushing some way to green as well. Those Pumas are just doing work torching down, torching down his town. Oh, Red's here too! Oh my goodness! Yellow oh, is. Pushed. Yellow, oh, Yellow has goodness. nothing on water either. So does have a few, few bills in the back there. If yellow didn't have red in this base, I, he would be able to deal with orange okay here, but not anymore. I don't think he win, win either one, but yeah, the, 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 the double team is really, really not helping out here. Man. All right, looking south. Cavalry are still being spawned in. I don't, oh, there are barracks. Okay. I was going to say, I still don't see a barracks. Uh, the factory is under siege. Uh, also, just slight comment here. Deccan Elephant is age five. No big deal. Ooh, the, I am really enjoying this, this Russian room. Zoom. I really hope we see some mass, mass musk and can, uh, mass musk and falcons. 
Yeah, he really, I think he needs to push orange here. He's got this score, so to take all that, there's still a lot of hunts and such there, so to take all that would help him a lot. Green Factory is down. Meanwhile, Orange is still relentlessly putting up the assault on Yellow. Red has decided to pull out. And... France... Targeted once again. <clears throat> Alright, looks like uh, Green has successfully defended against the Aztec invasion. And... Both players are still on the water. They are the only players on the water. I am shocked that only two of six decided to go water, but hey. Hopefully the Coyotes can get some damage here, but I really... He's building Jaguars, Blues, but he has such small groups of them I feel like they can't do much. Yeah, that's a good point. All right, Veteran Musks are here. What is yellow gonna do? Yellow back against the wall. This is why I love this map because you have nowhere to go. You must face your opponent. <clears throat> Seen a lot of mace chillin', but I don't know about this. They're not that strong. Huh? Especially if you throw them into Hussar like that. <laughs> are you telling me guys who throw rocks are not effective? <laughs> I mean, what, what in, they do like what 40 damage if they have twice the rate of fire two the dps is nice yeah, yeah. <clears throat> i do not like the wind up for them i feel like that that hurts a lot so, not overall not a bad play looks like orange might be starting to uh no i guess it's a I don't, I don't like seeing a Puma, Puma Mace Chillin' combo against, against Mustafar or against British. I think he's gone for the Cav. Because the Puma just, just rip Cav up. With they the five do. times, so. Or at least that's what I he's think. He's only age three, though. Yeah, that's rough. He does have another town center way back in there. He is ready to board Cyan. I don't, know. I don't think it's enough. I think he'll end up getting pushed too hard here. All right. Well, he did take down a factory, so not all doom and gloom for blue yet. Potentially later. Uh, Orange is still on the march, trying to figure out where yellow's at. And red's yeah, chilling really out. Hoping a lot of musk. Really hoping to see a lot of musk, but very sad seeing those all. Go down. He does have lots of Puma over here. I guess Puma do have the same damage as a Musketeer in hand attack, and it looks like he has he has slightly less hit points. So even even if they <clears throat> get killed in the range, if they can swarm them, they might do okay. Yeah, I'm interested to see why he has no priests out. He has no attack dance going for him. That's that's pretty. That's not not good for him. I he didn't have the four warrior priest H two. I think I for the I think it's three actually warrior priest H two, and that really hurts. Although very nice massive puma. Yeah. All right, let's see what happens here. Very. That was a nice bait and switch right there. Mm -hmm. Looks like some yellow is sneaking in behind Orange a little bit. You might be able to take refuge there. <laughs> Inside that wall barrier? Just, just oh, that's great. Right there. <clears throat> All right, rocks are being Ooh. thrown. Cyan is moving in on Orange. Very small Cyan army, is but... moving on, yeah. Imperial Cossacks. There we go. Uh, I think Green needs to get some siege here if he wants to actually be effective with these pushes. Maybe some Grins or a Mortar or two. Very, Cyan's just very slowly marching into the orange. He is here. Imperial Musketeer and Imperial Cossack. Oh, 
Uh, he needs to build a forward base here. Yeah, Orange is... Score is pretty close, so he might be able to age up here soon. Looks like he's engaged. I'm surprised there's no chats going, no voice chat happening yet. Or uh, text chat. Orange is, is yeah, he's pretty much up there by him. He really, Cyan really needs mortars and cannons. Going must contact is not going to work against walls, especially with rest kits. Yeah, that's a good point. It's not where it's at. All right, Green has made it in. I was completely wrong. He doesn't need any siege. Yeah, there's no town dance going. The walls are not upgraded. Uh, Blue just didn't really do, couldn't really do much to stop him. I'm surprised there's not more fighting going. He has so many ships out here on the water. And it looks like Green would see those. That's a good but point. Just mostly let him sit there. All right, Aztec, what are you going to do? Yeah, figure it out. It's a reminder the top four players will come away with some uh, earnings from this match, so we'll see who remains. I'm not sure why Blue is so heavy on the wood right now. Maybe it looks like he might be trying to build a fleet, but he's got a lot of bills just on wood. Even though he doesn't have a lot of bills in general. Yeah, that's a good point. <laughs> Looks like he's trying to raid, though, with some coyotes into green space. Okay, it looks like Orin's going to try to push Cyan now. Yeah. And there are the mortar, but there against, they are. Against, um, against Musketeer and Rockets, the mortars aren't going to do that. Yeah, this isn't DE, sorry. Maybe he was confused. Hey, that, that, that's not out there yet. That's not out there. <laughs> sorry, I maybe he plays too much China. There we go. We'll put that out there. <laughs> I I don't know why he has such a small army. This is not, yeah, not what? the pop that he needs to fight. So I'm not sure. Oh, oh, the heavy uh, horse. There guns. it is, yep. <laughs> there comes five. There's 20 population. <laughs> They aren't imp though, so let's see what. Not yet. I guess the rockets aren't either, so it's pretty good. Great combat here. No coals yet. That's I. I'm I'm kind of disappointed not seeing any coal bricks yet. But maybe the maybe the imperial oh imperial horse guns. They might be able to hold off this this push by orange. There's a nice boom back going on here. Factories seem pretty protected. Yeah, orange is age five, so if anyone's gonna rival teal right now, it's definitely him. Ooh, but can can the Cossacks get the rockets? Probably not. I got oh, one. There's one. I got two. Oh, now he needs to push. He needs to push. Puma Pants joins the Imperial Age. There are there is some grins coming out from Orange, which grins are not a bad idea versus versus Russia. But you need a nice you need a larger amount of them. Let him get his there eco going. Poor guy's here, getting there. Like top top left of Orange's base, there is four Cossacks just sitting there. <laughs> the Alright, we'll check back I half an hour later. If they, if they get in there, that could cause some annoyance. <clears throat> yeah, it looks like Blue's just been completely destroyed pretty much. Yeah. Oh, he finally got a town. He did he finally, finally get a dance. Good for him. It looks like he's going pure navy is his uh, strategy right now. Look at his navy. He's got some war canoes in there. That's a lot of war canoes. <laughs> That's a lot of canoes. <laughs> My only problem with canoes is I feel like with these with these outposts out here on the middle, they just won't be able to do anything. Yeah, they're, they're, they do have a canoe that is good at siege, though. If he puts that out, oh. 
I think it's age four though. But I think it's 500 coin as well. It's oh, that, that'll do it. Well, more canoes nope. then. That's the answer. <laughs> oh, red has deployed the hot air, hot air balloon and sees yellow's three new TCs. <laughs> that, Oof, that is so unlucky. Or uh, yellow. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, he, oh, there goes the army heading straight that way. That's Not a very large army on red's part, but... Oh, he does have some some heavy some horse artillery getting stuck in his town over here, though. All right, naval warfare has commenced. Fiery darts are going against big beefy ship. I mean, he has a very large mass. He mm -hmm. very well might win the water. And he is doing the water dance too. That is that is actually a very strong navy right there. How many people, though, does he have? Is that like, like ten? Maybe? Yeah, half half dance. And the range on these so crazy. But I I don't think they'll be able to take down the like, drop, even with this large mass. So that's a lot of area that green will control there. The canoes actually take multiple hits from the uh, outpost now. <clears throat> oh, because. Water dance. That's kind of crazy. <clears throat> All right, here they go. Looks like three shots, maybe. Yeah, outpost yeah, getting melted. That's crazy. Maybe his. Maybe his strategy is uh, I need to get on this center island before I'm dead. <laughs> if he can clear out this outpost and get down that second factory, that'll really hurt Green. Especially can. There's basically no more fish on the water. Yeah, that's a good point. All right, meanwhile, orange and teal are going at it. Grens have entered the battlefield. I feel like orange's army wins here. Well, oh no, there is there's more enforced guns coming in. I did see a, a coal from orange, but it got it got. Bayoneted. Looks like Cyan actually might at the top get through and get to Orange's eco. Halb's on the way! <laughs> there they are. Oh no, that's a, that spells a lot of trouble. Yeah, that's a lot of Halb's. I think I think Cyan might be a very good one. Just going off of how much he's he's very focused on where he needs to be focused, getting into the economy and such. He does not want to take this main battle. He just wants to get in the base. That's good points. Grens are responding though. Let's see these Grens go at these halves here. Are they gonna do anything? Oh no, they, they sneak through. Wow. Does he only okay, no, he has two packs. They're slightly spread out, so he probably is going to get one down, maybe not two, but we'll see here. Looks like he may not have the siege card on. Mm. He, may not, he may not be able to take that down there. I am seeing coals from orange now, so that's, that's good. Clear out the... I think if if he can counter the cannon of from... Uh, from Russia with the Colves. If he can micro that well, I think he can win this fight. But so far, he's just losing his Colves. Yeah, that's a good point. All right, one factory is down. Many Halbs remain. These Grens are tossing their grenades. They're trying to get him out of there. I think I, they're not going to be able to get the second one so far. But he does have another mass coming. I, right now, Orange looks like he's in a very tough spot. And Cyan still has the, the highest score, so his E is a lot better. Uh, green has gone H5, so that puts it uh, way up against Blue to come back now. Uh, Blue has actually found Yellow's old base. Fascinating. And Yellow has also found his old base. <laughs> Yellow, where is Yellow? I guess he just got a few builds around. 
Oh, he is. He has a little bit. Looks like orange. Orange is trying to. Uh, orange is trying to, to sneak his way out of losing this fight. But I mean, yeah. he's gonna attack Cyan, like green, I guess. But he has no board base. Yeah, decent response from Orange. I kind of like how he's playing the Grens here. You don't really see Grens going at uh, pure heavy infantry too often. If he can do Grens and Colves, that, especially with how light uh, Cossacks are, they might actually do too well. Yeah, that's a good point. He's resigned! Yeah. Doesn't have enough eco. Orange is out! So far, I have not seen a single Horon, so... That's so sad. Tears everywhere. I want to see him. What? <laughs> Yellow is building petards to siege down... <laughs> 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 I love this game. What is that? Uh, he got a house. He got I'd... two houses. That's amazing. I feel like if you're yellow and blue, you don't want to burn this bridge. Yeah, yeah, them. exactly. This, it seems like just a petty squabble. <laughs> I, I ain't sure about that. <laughs> this is fantastic. But it looks like yellow is getting cleaned up. Although he has a better score than blue. That is fascinating. Are you kidding me? <laughs> More pet tards enter! <laughs> what is this? I'm so... Oh. They're actually gonna make it. Look how low the uh, attack is on those guys and on those petards. Wow. He did get both war huts. I wonder who Cyan goes for next. He's dropping down walls and looks like he's taking all of Orange's place. Yeah, but, I, I wanna see him and Green go at it. That'd be spicy. I, it, so far, he might be just trying to take down Orange's TC so he can build there. Yeah, that's a good point. It looks like he's heading over toward red and such. And red and has can, also entered the fray again. Can yellow and blue set aside their differences <laughs> to fight off red? <laughs> red just it. literally just builds a town. We have a bar <laughs> going up here, some barracks, houses, stable. <laughs> oh, that's great. I mean, blue might, I I think blue might be able to make like a treaty with Cyan. It might be a good way to salvation. That's a great point. Yeah, he's going to get cleaned out here. I guess his, his uh, army on the water did all die. They died, yeah. The once green went imperial, it was no go. Man of war to work. Cyan's still marching, marching his way through, and he is he's dropping forward artillery foundries and stables over here. But he's pulling up. Yeah, I haven't seen any native action yet. I really want to see him here. Yellow's still deploying, uh, <laughs> pet charts. How? There's no more, that was, they must have just survived that somehow. Trying I mean, to run with, <laughs> These poor bills. They were trying to run, but they just got cannonballed right in the face. <clears throat> oh. Oh, but those the cut the canoes did get Green's factory on the middle island. Oh, that's a good I point. That. that is good. Hi, neighbor. I'm stray. It's like, I have no neighbor. All right, Red, are you going to engage the teal blob? I, I would be worried as if you're, or if you're teal and red, if you go at it, green could just absolutely boom. That's a great you. point. I am more, more worried so for, for red than for, for 
or Siam now because it's green. Green still has not dropped any forward bases over the border. No aggression over there. Looks like all green wants to do is boom right now. Yeah, so yellow and blue are refugees everywhere and anywhere. Teal, red, and green are the powerhouses. It looks like green's building walls for the first time ever. <laughs> hey, at least he's getting walls up. Little bit late. He already lost the fact. <laughs> That's hilarious. The timing on that was not good. But yes, walls. Hey, there's the Huron. Yeah. 119 C. How could that you not? How could you not like these guys? That is pretty great. I mean, 53 range attack as well. Nothing to laugh at. I just love that they throw a fat axe. All right, here they come. That's actually excellent for Russia. That is an excellent combo for Russia. And he gets some Nutka in there, maybe? Do, are these, they do count as infantry, and it looks like they might have built instant. Not 100% sure, I kind of missed that, but it. That would the be. The way they freaked out of there. Well, there is a I shipment think. that spawns I don't know if it's 20 of them. There's a shipment that spawns a lot of them at once. Uh, that that might have been it. If they're instant, that's uh, fascinating. I would like to see if they are. Very slow army now, though. But... <laughs> Gosh, there's so many. That is native support. OK, instantly dropping down some forward buildings. Him and Red look about to go at it. Here we go. 40% range resist on 537 health on our rounds. Uh huh. Red coats probably do nothing. Yep. Yeah, I definitely need some cavalry. Although cannons will do well against them because they do have the. Cannons will will do fairly well. Trades everywhere. More Huron on the way. Fort is trying to be constructed. Absolute Russia destruction. Oh, oh, that's his fort. Oh, that's that could be bad. bad. If it, instant infantry out of the fort there. Oh, the halbs completely come. <laughs> oh, halbs and her on mantlets with some cannon. That could be insane. It did go down though. How did he get that down? Wow. I think I think Red had done a lot of damage. Yeah. Was that. All right, it is down. Does <clears throat> does. Uh, Cyan have the rebuild thing though? He does. He can just rebuild those. No Nuka though. No Nuka yet. I mean, that'll be devastating once he gets those in there. I don't know if anyone can stop this though. The house of Huron with the cannon support is just so strong. That's looking good right now. All right, well, red has been wiped from the area. Oh, I think uh, maybe red's ships helped out here. Red's got some ships on the shoreline. Yeah. Oh, no, he has two monitors. There you go. That was it. <clears throat> I find it funny, these two docks just sitting here shooting these ships. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Where is the cannonball even coming from? <laughs> And I love how they, they have the cannonball tech for... Uh... Oh! There's his army! <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> oh my. Was that... Is that there the whole time? Or... I don't know. Did, did they... Those? He's going back in green! <laughs> he does still have... I wish he would have been on the... the warrior priest dance over here this whole time. He hasn't been fighting for Oh, that's hilarious. But... 
All right, the teal blob is continuing to push. Britain's gonna have to figure it out. I think you need some native support, Brits. You gotta, you gotta thing. I do like the cap here, but the helps. Okay, Dragoons coming in. Dragoons will not do well against Skurons. Not at all. Well, I, well. They'll do, they'll do decent against the Russian heavy infantry, actually, since they're a little weaker. Yeah, but not against the Hurons. 40% range is just too much. All right, we're seeing the monitor uh, attack coming in. Very helpful taking down these forts. That's kind of the saving grace right now for him. He has split the, the teal army up, so he's going to be able to take out half of it there. And that is it a lot of the native support. It appears Blue's army. That's rough. His fleet died. He, yeah, but he is rebuilding up here. Yeah, there he is. All right, we see you. We see you, T. Okay, helps in the red base. Oh, they're trying. Those probably won't do anything, but if you can make a hole in the Cossacks. <clears throat> Man, dude, uh, Imperial Hus does some damage against those Ruskets. <laughs> it does some damage. Oh, oh those Halbs uh, don't know how to siege right now. They look completely stuck. They're a little bit lost. A little lost. All right, many more reinforcements. A lot. I, those got to be instant. Look how fast yeah, those they, came they, in. They, they are instant. Uh, fort oh, is nice. down. I guess he needs to build that fort over further away from water. Like his... Are not, this is only 150 resources. That's not that bad. Look at uh, Teal's walls. He looks like an infection. <laughs> That's pretty funny. All right, he is building the fort on the side, just like you said. Hey. I think Charons and Ruskets, I think they beat... They, they might not, but I feel like they should be the Tier combo. As long as he does... It, yeah, those are definitely instant. <laughs> there is no way those aren't. Alright, Cossacks are running for raids. And that is a lot of mantlets that are about to get clobbered up. Red's desperate to get two. Stand and fight, I mean, 53 range attack. They can do, do plenty of good damage. Uh, That's a good point. That's Forward base over toward a land base. And a wall going up. Who wants to take all that? All right, Yellow's got a little base going on the very north, too. Wonder... Yes. Oh, he did have a few builds in there. I wonder if he can yeah. He can build up in there. He might, he might be <clears throat> back. I do like the double port here. That's, that's fair. Yeah, Red probably needs a mortar. At least just one mortar to put some damage on those. Oh, there's the Imperial Horse Guns. Blowing infantry away. It looks like Green is mobilizing to attack you over here. Yeah, we have some cavalry ready to go. Not a surprise. Oh, we have ships. <laughs> the Navy is deploying. It has arrived. Oh my yeah, goodness. In there. Several galleys, two monitors. It's all coming out. I also love that he has no walls on this middle island. That just terrifies me. It's just the easiest place for a for a drop. Uh, my only I think Cyan might have boomed a little too much. Mm-hmm. 
score might have just been a little bit too high. Yeah, he's oh, a definite target. Look at that. Mask over here, though. Unbelievable. <laughs> so many units. Oh. Green, I'm on a fight. Yeah, I don't think Green's gonna let you yeah. have this in the finals. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that's amazing. Uh, oh my goodness. He's like, that's the point, bro. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's, that's pretty great. That is pretty great. He really needs, if he's, I mean, he basically, he won against Red here, so he needs to push into this army. <clears throat> yeah, he needs to wipe uh, Red out as soon as possible. He has all the siege. The one thing that, uh, that Russia might be able to... Oh, there's the nuke uh, 67 siege. The one thing Russia might be able to do here is just instant pop out armies, though. So it's hard to, hard to raid them. Blue still lives. He's got more canoes going at green. <laughs> That's hilarious. I think this dock died and there was canoes in it and then they all spilled out. All right, green is at the door of teal. Teal is at the door of red. Who is going to knock in? Ooh, both those walls are down. He's completely in there. No outposts, but he is trying to get a board up. So that can get up in time, but it looks like it will. Ooh, that can really hurt. There is an instant help, help span coming out here. So That's a good point. Maybe those can protect his bills some, but he needs, he needs to get his bills in. All right, heavy hits here. Uh, meanwhile, uh, Musket Enjoyer and Llama OP are forming again. Yes. Longbows behind walls. The fort did get up. That's, I don't know how much longbows would do against the, the, the Huron. I mean, they'll have good DPS, but... I think with the, with the cannons back there in the Hurons, I don't think they'll do that. Yeah. It's got to really it use that range. The, it does have the range. Did he delete some cannons here? Who, Teal? Yeah, I think he deleted a couple cannons so he could go for guys over here. Yeah, probably. He hit one culvert and has saved the day on the uh, Russian shoreline. All right, so far, so far he's managing. Say that again. It's amazing how much one cold will do against ships. It is, yeah. I would like to see another outpost right over here. I am a little further forward. Those halves are having to run a pretty good distance. No strelats though. Yeah, not yet. I mean, are they really worth building? I don't know. Not when you have mantlets. I think mantlets are a better play. All right, Caver, trying to raid again. So it's going to be interesting to see how this population shift works for Teal. If he's going to be able to have enough on each front to hold and push. I mean, so far it looks like he does. But the longbow spam might over here might hurt. Yeah, Red's also deployed his, his Cherokee support as well, so that's going to be kind of helpful, I feel like. They, do, they don't do a lot of damage right now, but here's only H, what, 4? Would like to see an imp upgrade on them. Boost them, boys! Like, looks like Cyan gave up over here. He just wants to push back green. Even if Red can push over here where Cyan is pushing, he has a long way to go to get to his base. He does have a long way to go. Or he could do a boat drop. He could, he could. Could, could uh, ignore all of that. But Me the only the only problem with that is green is up on score now. <laughs> so does red really want to team with him now? Yeah, maybe just let them drain each other. Meanwhile, the French Empire exists. <laughs> we have two mills and a plantation. 
And we have uh, Aztecs going at him. There's still beef Why? between these guys. <laughs> Why is he CG yellow? I'm so confused. I love how he built four outposts in a cube. I'm just so confused as to what the point of attacking yellow is. I guess he just doesn't want to be third or whatever. What is he? Oh, that's a good point. Yeah. He just doesn't want to be fifth. That's a good point. Yeah, whoever uh, whoever lasts this battle here will get... Uh, I gotta look at the prize money. I don't even remember what I'm giving people. Uh, fourth place is $25. Third is 50. Second, 75. First is 150. He wants to ruin all his chances for $25. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the FFA tourney. Man. At least we're not getting Venmo burger bribes. That's. I, that, I, like, I'm surprised we haven't gotten that yet. Oh, man. I'm also surprised they're not even communicating. You know what I'm saying? I'd be like, green and blue, come on here. Unless they're private messaging. Wait, can we see private messages? I don't know. Uh, we, we should be able to see all the chats in here. Oh, okay, all of them. I think. I don't know where Russia's army is. Uh, I don't know. There's a lot of Huron in the base. I would like to see him move some bills over, which it looks like he has some. But now that this has been broken into, those Huron are the game changer. Yeah, that extra pop, the extra pop is insane. Honestly, against British, I might would like some heavy cannon from, from Russia. That's a good point. British. But do, do, do legacy British or uh, Russia? I guess they don't get the artillery train time. Um, they, they do in DE now, but I forget if they do in legacy. British. They have the mortar card. I don't think they have a engineer card. Know. All right, uh, Green has successfully broken through on the shoreline, and looks like he's gonna spawn in using that galley. Red is pushing up as well on the west coast, too. Honestly, I think Cyan needs to make a deal with, with Red here. Otherwise, he's, he's most definitely done for. No, no one got the middle treasure yet. <laughs> I'm a hot dude. Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> Mr. Object Orient said, Oh, if Burger's coming to play, I will keep chat GPT ready. <laughs> that's amazing. Do you know that's what he used to get those titles? Did you see that? Yeah, that's what I heard. That was yeah, that's amazing. All right, uh, Teal's about to lose one of these native posts, so there is going to be a significant reduction in his yes. Huron deployment. I mean, Red really needs to break this pact with Green, I think. I mean, no, I, I guess I guess they're about ever. All three are about. Me. I guess you have to double team someone, but Cossacks in the back of Green's base. Oh, look at that spawn! Ports dropped. Two forts dropped. Oh that my is, goodness! That is beautiful. I was wondering where all that pop space was. But he's, he's out there. Wow! Spicy play by Teal here. Man, Imperial Pavlov's the Grins out yep. here. 140 C. Come on. I love this play here. Very, very good play here. That is excellent. That is fantastic. Wow. Out of absolutely nowhere. I guess he just snuck a couple months back there. The, the diplomacy begins. Totally There's no more fish. I love no, seeing... I love seeing in these diplomacy negotiations what people offer. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, the I have the water, but there's no fish in here, so it's not worth your. It's not worth anything now. 
I do see five privateers. Looks like red is rolling up a fleet. So he might try to contest green there. The, pi the pirates Honestly. are here? I love it. That's what, great. What I would like to see is just a three-way <laughs> battle. Like a full, every single one battling each other. And then blue comes back and wins. But, um. <laughs> uh, green is basically all out on the center island now. I don't know if Teal is going to realize that either. He is... It looks like Teal is also holding up green at his base, though. He did rebuild those walls to his ego. So red is pushing in. Yeah, this is, this is going to be very fascinating. I was going to conclude here. Man. Cossacks on the move. Just trying to find... find Teal. I don't like that they're letting green have all those green. Really need to take those down. What's I point. forget what each trade post is worth. Each trade post is worth. Like Corvilles or something? About. I don't know. I, I don't know that uh, math. All I know is they're helpful to my economy. <laughs> <laughs> Man, very insane siege on all these units, though. From, from Russia. Yeah. That that fifty percent on all infantry is so good. I don't like that he's leaving these dudes in the town centers in life though. They are just hanging out there, aren't they? That's kinda of funny. Alright, Green's still trying to get in. He's using his navy here and there, but has failed to completely press forward. His eco is gonna be secure on the center island. So yeah, we'll see what happens with Teal like here. He only, it looks like he can only fit like seven on him. So that's only 70 bills. That's not, that's not super sus sustaining. Sustainable? Yeah. Yeah, we'll see. It'll be interesting. Oh, he's going to take down the outposts and put more. It's going to be, I think it's going to be decent. I think he's going to be able to have enough. To keep up something. All right, red is really continuing. I don't know if red accepted Cyan's uh, allyship, but if not, oh, he's I'm engaging in the north right now. Oh, that's really no. Cyan might just need to take green space. <laughs> That's a good but point. That, that would be... He needs to take all this area where blue is at least. Start walling that. But if he can push up and destroy all green scores based on that, um, clearing those up would help him a lot. It looks like blue... It looks like yellow is kind of beating blue now. Blue's running from him. Um, if we can see a French comeback, that might be... Don't let the French rebuild. <laughs> Everyone should know that. Yep, French cavalry are here. Man, this is going to be fascinating. Look at the map, just multicolored. It's like, it's like a scary rainbow. I don't know. It, it's kind of disturbing how <laughs> conglomerated everything is. I don't know. I don't like seeing red, orange, and yellow mixed together. That's not not very fun on the eyes. Fire. Cyan really has to has to get out of here. I think he really can't fight green and red. Green score has gone down some. But heels is going down the road, down as well. Red is on top. Yeah, that's fascinating. If yellow and blue a team up with cyan to fight green and red, I think that's their best chances for each one. That's a good point. Good point. Plenty to play for.
Musket Enjoyer has got that wild rice. 300 food treasure. I bet that tastes really well, good right I, now. Here at the Great Lakes. <laughs> Cyan is doing amazingly well with his defense. It's very easy. He's playing that really smart. I think. Doing the best he can. Two v one v two. Yeah, he's been holding for a hot minute now. Red is knocking though. Red does have some horons coming out. He needs to get those horse artillery to shoot. Christian Rodriguez, welcome to the revolution. Appreciate you, sir. Hope you're enjoying the action. Lots of action today. I'm guessing Cyan doesn't know this, but Red only has two air walls from, from the train. So his ego is actually fairly exposed. All right, he's, he's playing. <laughs> <laughs> dead. Uh, yeah, Cyan's so dead back here. I do like Cyan's micro on the cannons. He's doing that really well. At this point, now green needs to stop fighting him. Yes. The Red Navy is deploying Britain everywhere. Yes. Man. Yeah, Teal has been doing a great job on defense here. Man, Yellows. <laughs> CJ. That'd be uh, so sad. Bad. He did so much. I think he did overplay the economy though a little bit. Yeah. You can't you can't peek above the rest. It's so early. Looks like green is rebuilding over here. He did also manage to get at least I think two more buildings on the middle island. Yeah, two more. So that's 90 bills now. Man. All right, Teal's deploying uh, towards red. We got some Cossacks. And uh, there's a horse gun following them. <laughs> <laughs> that's amazing. Uh. I really hope, I really want yellow and blue to put their differences to that aside and attack red. That's that's what I want to see most. They're both age three. They need to get some age ups going here. How are they still both age three? I mean, oh, yellow just went four. Ah, uh, the, the dragoons will absolutely wipe the Cossacks over here. But maybe, hopefully, Teal sees this, this uh, factory. Honestly, a grin mass into into red face. Insane. It would be devastating. Uh, meanwhile, three TCs on the very southern side of the map for Teal. A and a wall of houses. That's amazing. I'm surprised <laughs> that there's still just like moose everywhere. Yeah, there's a lot of hunts that people have not used. Moose and hunts and coin just all over. Aztec does have a TC up finally. I feel like he he took the role play a little bit, a little bit too far and just attacking everyone without. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I, I'm not I'm not so sure about this. Oh, he has two. He has one up in the south as well. Man, the border of this map is being hugged like nothing you've ever seen. He built a fire pit, but then it appears he deleted it. So I don't, I'm not sure what that's for. Farm. That is why he wants everyone hidden. Man, rough times elsewhere in the world. 
Teal's base is almost wiped. Not quite, though. What is going to happen next? Are we going to see red and... Oh, Imperial has been hit from the French. They live! Only, the only problem I think red and green might have is just that they kind of have to commit now to finishing off Cyan. Because if he comes back, and he can really play Kingmaker if he can come back. That's a good point. He has a Grand Mass. Deploying. Oh, oh. Oh, let's go. Uh, what is that? 140 times 1.3. How much is that? Do the math. 182 Siege. That's that is so good. Plenty. Will it one shot a factory though? That's all he needs. I'm amazed that red still hasn't put any more walls. Or I would have eight layers of walls all around that factory right now. All he needs these this is enough grins. All he needs is thirty eight grins to one shot that factory. He's going for you, red. He can see it with his walls. Advised? No, he see, he walked yeah. past his walls here. <clears throat> That's hilarious. The thing. I I really hope Red like just builds a bunch of infantry because he thinks like he's coming with Cossacks or something. <laughs> that would be that'd be pretty fabulous. Oh Red, no. where is his other factory? I'm so confused what's happening right now. Where's Red's other factory? It might be down. It might have gotten destroyed. He's on your town. He's about to see it right now. Radar! Badoop, badoop, badoop! <laughs> Shawshank! Hi, Sam. Love from India. I have a question for you. If, say, you were playing in this as Dutch, then which infinite shipment would you choose? Three frat privateer, 300 wood, or eight halbs? That's a tough question. The privateer shipment's pretty spicy. I feel like that would be really nice. You could just stack those, so I'd probably do that one. Grin say bye bye. Oh, that's a good point too. The infinite fusiliers are nice. They don't get the imp upgrade though, like they do in DE, so they, they really mm. won't be as good as they are. They have what infinite carib? Is that their native? The blowgunners. Yeah, but they already have such good skirm, it feels kind of pointless. Yeah. The wall's coming up for Cyan down south. Another factory being, or another fort, sorry, being dropped over here towards red. Looks like he wants to insta-spam and destroy his eco. Green's eco full on in the middle. Nine, yeah, I'm... <laughs> nine eagles out here. Oh my goodness. Nine in the middle. Maybe, maybe you should, maybe Danzel should have made that bigger. <laughs> No, that's that's the perfect yeah. size. I like that. Uh, I like that. Ninety bills. That is insane. Wow. All right, Red. What's your game plan? Red looks like he's pulling his army. He is attacking blue TC from the water, but his army is pulling south to meet you. The base is open. Musketeers come in. I feel like we need some Cossacks here. I guess the, the Dragoons are coming, so they wouldn't end up doing much. Red does have three native posts now, so he could... He could deploy several units. Thank you for your uh, donation, Shashank. I don't think there's really a necessarily wrong answer. Any infinite shipment is better than none. That's kind of my mindset there. All right, Britain has responded. Russia's eco is still recovering here. I feel like for Cyan and or for Cyan, he needed to just be done with that fort and just go hide and just chill out. Yeah, that's a good if point. He continues to make, if he continues to make enemies, I don't know if 
I don't think he wants to do that. Yellow score is starting to skyrocket a little bit. Oh, I was thinking the same thing. I think they are direct messaging that we can't see. It looked like he replied <clears> to something <throat> Red said. I didn't see Red didn't say anything. No, Red said uh, we need to take out Teal and M1v1. Oh, okay. I only went blue out. Why? What did yellow and blue do? How did that start? Uh, blue. No, yellow I, does have a chance. Did you see the chat? Blue's yellow said, "This is karma for you attacking me," and then blue is like, "I'm sorry, I was bored." Oh, oh, we're gonna miss that. France is not more dangerous than blue. Well, for now. <laughs> Man. For now, he is. I mean. So much to play for. We've had a lot of action. We're only an hour and 12 minutes in. <laughs> Sticks <and stuff. laughs> you chose them. Uh, is that his first warrior priest? There's his first couple warrior priests. Good for him. That's not coming out. He's still age 3 though. <laughs> Good for him. Uh... And he's gone industrial. Lepardo Gaming tosses out the huge donation. Viva la revolution. Great game. Let's see some more diplomacy, backstabbing, and gritty fighting. That's what we've been seeing all day. Appreciate you, your support, my friend. Hope you're enjoying it. Uh, yellow here is going to be the wild card. To say the least. Don't forget burgers in <laughs> trans. Sorry, go ahead. Honestly, I feel like uh, green's obviously the wild part here. Because I feel like blue is for sure going to get big and do well. But green, depending on how his his diplomacy with red continues, it seems like they want a one to one so they might just keep teaming. But this is definitely red's game to lose. I don't know, you think he's got enough control right now? I think either red or green both have the control right now, but they're working together. I don't know if one's... I don't know, that's hard. But the one thing I would put on... on uh, one reason I would put up red over green is the that his barracks are a lot more spread out open now. And his, his buildings are, so he can respond to different ways. That's a great point. But with Galleons in play, I mean, green can really come from anywhere. Yeah. So, I mean, but ultimately, I think green loses this if he loses if he loses his outside, which he doesn't have enough buildings, I think, to keep it. He will eventually lose the middle, I believe. <clears throat> but we'll see how that goes. Teal is getting sandwiched again. Thank you, everyone, for your support today. I love the nice, like, reddish pink chat box that uh, it gave you there, a little part of it. Looks cool. Love the different colors. All right. Is blue going to come back? They have an economy now, so that's something. And he's age four. Warrior Priest exists. I think I think if he had that war, four Warrior Priest, that would have helped him so much. Look at He has also a northeastern side. Town center. He's just going around the map building TCs. He has been up there most of the game, I feel like. He had three builds survive a couple of raids. Man. And he's just been sitting there. Still very heavy on wood. I guess he wants to drop down um, farms and such. Yeah. Does Teal have anything alive other than what's south? Oh, he has two villagers to the very north. Man. Up in his base. I feel like I don't know how much wood he has, but I was certainly into this wall that he has a build. As Explorer is on the run. It is going westward from the TC. He has escaped. He's got two musketeers on him. He's running. 
Is he gonna make it? He see the explorer? Do you see what I'm talking about? Yeah. He's tracking. I feel like if I'm red here, oh Rogers Rangers come out. <laughs> Blue stage four and you live. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh this? Clemson gifts five memberships congratulations all y'all with the memberships wait a minute green plays spies that is massive oh my goodness Ooh. everything's happening at once thank you Clemson for your support we get five successive lightning strikes. It's fantastic. All right. I think that's supposed the end for Zion. Spies. This is that's a good point. Yeah. He can't run. But he did get a, his explorer out. If he can go hide it over here in Blue's base, just hide his explorer. Uh huh. Uh huh. Try to blink. It. Thank you, Clemson. Well, congratulations, everyone who uh, got some memberships there. Dude, yellow, he is tricking you. <laughs> yellow did pass the thousand score, so he is he's definitely building up. Yeah. I'm not sure what happened to his cav army. It's chilling on the what southwest of his base. Ah. This has turned into a British alliance. Fascinating politics here. What what were those two? I forget what two royal families fought over the crown, but that would have been a funny joke if it were. <laughs> so many potential references. Yellow did pass up Cyan now. After after long of battle. I I think I think Teal definitely has the best like micro and is the best fighter but mm -hmm. but it definitely definitely wish he he wouldn't have been 2v1 <clears throat> yeah if yellow could have gotten up just a little bit earlier that would have been good timing there are those speedy cdbs it's so funny watching them walk they look like teleporting got that like pace i want to see blues to do something here Oh, blue's getting sieged on the side by green. Green's not not letting blue live. <laughs> it looks like blue might have three docks here full of ships. <laughs> so I don't know how many ships, but red plays oh, spies. Red. Oh, oh, look at my <laughs> oh my goodness! Oh, oh, let's go. Oh, oh. N he wants to get green back. That is what he wants to do. He's just living yeah. to take out green. I Those... had it backwards. 400 wood and 100 coin on the, the tower. Ah. Oh. It said the reverse before. Very mat nice pop there. That is beautiful. He needs to heal him up, though. Yeah. Man. <laughs> We're not fighting since the beginning. <laughs> yep, just like that. I kind of I want blue to come back. <laughs> I want blue or I, maybe if yellow was in France, I'd want yellow to come back. But lots to play for here. Oh. Oh no, that was the last teal uh, no. villagers. Blue just deleted all of his ships. What the what? What a waste! Are you sure? Yeah, he just deleted all of them. What Green happened? Said if you Green said, "If you delete your ships, I'll let you live." So he deleted all of them. That's. I don't know about. What? what I don't. What's the <laughs> point of that? But it does look like he is rebuilding them inside the dock. So. <laughs> oh my goodness. Red's on yellow's base now. We're <clears throat> so much higher. There's just no way we yellow can pull this off. Yeah. 
I I don't know. I think uh, France can pull pull off uh, a shocker here, maybe. Well, the natives are not good. Natives are not good. Yeah, I mean, with with France, the skirms would do fine, but Huron's will take a lot of range, a lot of range attack. I like that there's just Rogers Rangers and they're just garbage. They're basically nothing. <laughs> At this point, yeah. They no make you. Out for red, though. Oh, that's a terrible. That's ter <laughs> that's the worst. Oh, as far as the lifeguard do pop out those. <clears throat> I love this pathing here from Yellow. He's got the skirms deep in the barracks. I like that. That's so smart. Uh, Teal is tracking for his explorer. He's got his musketeer mask going. One, where did those come from? He he uh, spawned them in the north with the uh, outpost ah, the blockhouse. blockhouse. And with red focusing on red focusing on yellow now. <laughs> Legit yeah, nine. Yeah, you're gonna throw because they're stuck. He's a little bit too packed for Yeah, too packed. If you had a few, if you had some cannons though, you'd do a lot of work here. <clears throat> did Yellow ever ship his factories? Oh, he did lose one at the start, I think. Maybe both. He has so many Hussar just sitting there stuck. That's so <clears throat> hard. It is not fun to see. Get out there, Cav! Go forward. Oh <laughs> my so goodness. Oh, that's, that's not so good. Fun. That's not good. All right. Uh, Teal has got a Ford up and his Explorers up, and he's built a town center. Uh, I mean, with red and green having spies, I don't. Uh, I don't think he'll he'll work that out. <clears throat> red, uh, yellow's getting pretty demolished. They're they're they're, they're getting in there now. Cavs are getting in there now. Green and red do not know each other, okay? They don't even know that they're playing in the finals together. No one knows anyone. <clears throat> All right, uh, two TCs are up for Teal. I wonder how many res he has left. Can we, we can actually see that, can't we? He's still at a thousand score, so Hussars are on him though. Because of a resource count. Oh. Yeah, yellow's getting cleaned up here. Dragoons on hand attack. I love it. Love to see it. <laughs> Man, They're, they got like little knives. It's so, it's kind of funny to watch. Them. Blue has got to be building the fattest navy. I think that because he has so many people on wood. Uh, his docks are only at fifteen forty-five damage. Yeah, they're 150 when they're full. So, I'm not sure how many that would be, but he does have a lot on wood. And he's building a massive puma. I'm not sure what his plan of doing that is. I can't wait to find out. Yellow is actually playing this really well, though, even though. 
Uh, the odds are against him. Even though the odds are against him, I do like the must. The musk in uh, the star is right here in the middle. Of the mm -hmm. well. They are Imperial Musk. So. That's impressive. Good for him. Impressive deployment there. Well, it looks like Red. Red's got one Hussar up in his base. Two Hussars, just killing, killing a lot of people. All right, here we go. Green is uh, calling out blue. Four boats. <laughs> oh, there literally were four boats. There are no boats there. Oh, that's fascinating. Oh, in, his, in his buildings. Yeah. Who, why is Green keeping tabs on how many boats he has? He, because he has what entire is economies in the middle of the map. Uh. I don't like how much Blue is just doing everything he says, though. That's not. That's he not well. Not chill, bro. He knows he'd die immediately. Also, can we agree that Aztec gates are just the coolest looking things? <clears throat> can can we? Like that is over here. It is uh what northeast base. Uh huh. The gates are just so cool looking. I I love them. They are they are pretty impressive. Yeah, I don't know who's like, yeah, we're going to put uh, nice wood sticks sticking out of the stone wall. But <laughs> it looks great. But it also has skulls, yeah. so then it's cool. <laughs> That's a good point. I do enjoy the Dragoon cannon combo here from Green. I hope he actually uses it. Other than, it looks like right now he's just running a no. little bit lost. I'm written for blue. I don't know about you. Aztecs all day. Yes. Aztecs all day. Is this the? I feel like green here and blue might have been from, might have been in the same game. I guess. Um, the one where British just ran around the map and killed a bunch of people. I feel, and then Aztec won a game that that game. I think. I feel like this, this, and green are out here doing the same players. All right, Red is uh, fully here with all the infantry, and again, no anti-cam. <laughs> I want to see this green island destroyed. He's so, he's his score is just insane. Now. And it'll do. He doesn't even have full build. No, I guess he's got some. Armor. He's just running around with his massive army and not doing anything with it. Yellow's been building up, up to the north, too. We always got that factory right next to Orange's factory. It looks like it's an orange factory. <laughs> no. Oh, that's so smart. That's amazing play. That is very... That's a great idea. He's not making any units, though. So I don't know his game. Oh, oh my... Over here. He has, like, 20 field guns. Look at the, the west side. <laughs> <laughs> is this yellow who has the field gun? Yeah, the north northwest. Oh my! <laughs> what are they doing? <laughs> I they're... mean, I'm not hating it. Oh, they're imperial now. He was upgrading them. I feel like he needs some coals there. Yeah. <laughs> we'll, we'll clear those. I like how he decided but, to do yeah. that instead of any cavalry. I I do like the play though. You gotta respect it. I like that. All right, I want to know how Teal is alive. Oh, he's he's down south. He has town centers alive. Gosh, he's. Oh, it looks like Green's gonna clear that up though. Wow. He's trying. Green is literally so greedy. He has one bill on these two coin crates of France. <laughs> Take the free like, coin, uh... man. He's just like three. He's like 500 coins or something, and he's just sent a bill to go get those. Uh, oh my! Check economy. Next, on... next, Sorry, go ahead. Next, he's just gonna get this. He's gonna get this random treasure here. Surprised no one's gotten it though. Okay. Or 80 XP. I can't. You can't see unspent resources. Thank you, uh, Messit. I don't know how you pronounce it. I'm sorry. 
Uh, Teal has 7,000 res left. Uh, blue or green has 142,000 oh, res. No. Red has I'm 83. So Blue all is this, getting some. All this Falconets are going into lumber for a second. Oh, uh, that's not cool. Yes, the mob! Blow them away! Go back to your island. Britain. <laughs> that's amazing. Said every country ever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. The last teal units are here. Oh, he still has more somewhere. His explorer is running it, away from the Pumas. <laughs> <laughs> Good why on him. him. Yeah, why are they chasing why? him? Teal is desperate. Come on, Teal. Blue just, blue just really wants that $25. I'm just putting that out there. Yeah, Blue really does. That's, that's exactly why he's doing this. <laughs> <laughs> you know it too. That's hilarious. Uh, <laughs> He's gonna try to build another one. Oh, Get it no. up, Blue. Leave me. Oh no! Is this his last unit? Is it? I think this is his last unit. <laughs> oh no! He's gonna act like he doesn't know. He totally knows. You're. Not, you can't tell He's me he doesn't so know. No. I'm not attacking you. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> wow. Oh, that is the most atrocious thing ever. That is. <laughs> the uh, yeah, he knew it. Kill? He 100% knew that. There, There's your 25, or, or I guess he's probably going to get third. But there's, there's your money, Blue. <laughs> there's your money, Blue. Wow. Yellow's oh, still holding. Those four, coves, those four coves from red just destroyed all his Falconets. Oh, really? Oh, no. They're all dead. Green is now being a bully. <laughs> yeah, blue fell for it hard there with those ships. All right, we're in the complaining stage of the tournament. Lots of complaining. I really hope he just misses that factory and doesn't realize. That would be the most beautiful thing. That would actually be amazing. <clears throat> You're spamming the wall. Yeah, look at the that walls here. <laughs> That's up north. What else do you want him to do? 27,000 hit points. That is crazy. Oh my goodness. Ah, uh, the, the Imperial horse gun did not blue. I just love the fact that there's like 30 musketeers just sitting here throwing torches at a brick wall. And it's just like very slowly dying. I am out of yeah. That was pretty great. <clears throat> this is hilarious. I am in the ashes. I'm in. Poor yellow though, he didn't even get a chance. He got squished right at the start. Yeah, that's true. You gotta love that as yeah. soon as a wall goes up, it goes from 7,000 hit points to 27,000. <laughs> uh, it was hilarious. <clears throat> Wait, who just. Oh no, he destroyed his own camouflage. These two factories destroyed the other four. Oh, wow. The other factory. Oh, these two cannons, sorry, destroyed the other factory. Bummer. No more camouflage. That's not fun. 
Is yellow anywhere else? I guess not. Oh, he's got a little bit down south. All right, I, th I think the play here is red takes out yellow and then tries to ally with blue. I think that's what red's yeah. got to do. I don't think he's going to be able to take out green because he, he doesn't have enough. I don't know. The, the resource count is heavily in green's favor, but he doesn't know that. Yeah, but I feel like they both have... Such high, I don't I don't know what the resources are, but I feel like they're both probably high enough so that red with the natives will be able to beat him. But, I mean, he's just stuck out there on the water, so... I don't know how much wood green has either. So if it turns into a water fight... <clears throat> green has 166,000 res. Oh, my. Red has 93,000. Wow. Okay, that's that's pretty far apart, but hopefully that's enough. Hopefully red just has enough to to fight. If I honestly, if I'm red here, I think I go ahead and start turning on green and start seeking all, get rid of every building. Yeah. The main shore. I feel like that's what he's got to do is just clear out the main shore. And once <clears> you do that, all you need is some colts and and dear, your opponent can't land. Good point. Well, you'd have to, like, wall off the middle. <laughs> that would be hilarious. <laughs> wall off the entire the, 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 ocean. The ocean, yeah. <laughs> uh. Man, yellow looks like he's gonna... Oh, he's building a town center on the far right. I don't think he... He can't build that yet. It's gonna get seen now. Yeah. You gotta hide, man. You gotta hide. I'm rooting for Aztec right now. That's who I'm rooting for today. Right, there's two oh. Brit players left, and I'm going to be rooting for Aztec. What world am I in? That's so funny. Looks like Blue is finally getting out some herbs. Yeah, if he has the economy for it, man. I mean, I have, I have not seen him gather any resource other than wood, I feel like. <laughs> he had this one farm and then a couple of states. Is this trading wood this like crazy? That is so funny. Probably selling a hundred wood for like ten coin right now. <clears throat> All right, he is on the press against green. Green's also. Green TC's being dropped by yellow. Oh gosh. <laughs> All right, yellow. Let's see what your game plan is. Yeah, if yellow gets taken out here, I think it's going to be very interesting to see what red does. I wonder if he knows how. I, I think he's got to know how much blue and green hate each other, right? I think he must. I don't know, we'll I'm see. I'm still kind of saddened that they just let Green have these two trade posts this whole time. Cyan did that and all that. Uh, a lot of free resources there. That is a lot of free resources. Alright, it looks like uh, Blue has successfully defended against Green and will live. Impressive. That's, our, that's been a very impressive recovery for Blue. He has been... All over the place, everywhere. And he's age four. He's not even age five. He, he... Oh, I guess he can go age five now if that green's attacking him anyway. Because <laughs> <clears throat> that's what he had said. I won't go age five, green. Don't worry. <laughs> I think he said that for... Was that for red or was that green? I thought that was green, but I don't think he'll care. Yellow's out! Three remain. Yellow will get the $25 fourth place prize. So right now, Blue's sitting on 50 bucks. <laughs> it's paying off for Blue today. I, I kind of feel like Blue has played the weasel today, honestly. <laughs> I'd say. He's just like snuck his way to here. <laughs> All right, what is gonna happen now in the diplomacy? Does Red team 
Yeah, what does, does red team with blue? What does red do? Uh, red, you can't 1v1 green. I you don't... can't. You, you, you definitely... I, I mean, the scores are really close, but... I've red needs more navy action too. I think red's got to get the navy ready. Let's end no! this. No, why would you kill him? Why would red go against blue? Oh, it's so sad. Oh. <clears throat> Poor blue. He's so oh, dead. No. <laughs> He's so dead. Wow. He's just getting squashed between the two biggest armies. All right, blue. You need to toss out your diplomacy here, buddy. Here it is. Oh, Here it go. is. There we go. We should. Come on. What is it? What is it? We should. Oh, best chances. That is true. <clears throat> what do you want, Red? Yes. No! Oh! 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 Everything changes. I'll oh. take oh it's turned around This is why we love free for all ladies and gentlemen because anything can happen in any oh moment my. The green oh fleet my. deploys Oh he's heading straight toward red Red needs to spam out some canoes right now Oh my goodness Green blue age up he <laughs> jumped blue. Oh my word, the manlets are destroying. Absolutely destroying the Aaron Knights here. They're just tanking so much damage. Blue my is goodness. pushing out. He's gonna start his raid. This is it. Oh, I love it. Eagle Knights look like they're going to try to sit out. He's trying to secure a water point. Man, you gotta love. The, the, the best thing about the sea battles is just the cannons and the cracking. Oh, it's the best. It's so satisfying. Yeah, the sound effects are amazing. These privateers are just sitting up here, though. You gotta get those in the fight. Yeah, it's gonna be really interesting to see. He's got uh, outpost support by his docks, so... Those will be able to deploy. Uh, I'm gonna look at uh, cards right real quick. Do we have any water cards? Red has offshore support. Um... Adds the five LOS and range. Was and then... the more ships card allowed? That allows you to build more warships? Is that allowed? Yeah, Admiralty. Mm -hmm. Oh, but no one got it. No one's got it. Uh, green has naval gunners and on red. improved warships. Pushing on red down south. He needs to elite this whole army except for his man that's over here. So he can defend over here. Oh, green's heading right into the base. Green's heading right in. They're marching. Come on, blue, you gotta get these up. Blue does have. He can't always do the unit build faster dance. He can spam out some boats really quickly here. The wood. Oh, he's building the docks. Oh, I want to. I want to see this Aztec Navy so bad. <laughs> he needs to age though. He needs age up. I don't. I don't know if he realizes he's not age five. It looks like with the ship support and the outpost, he will be able to clean up uh, Green's push in here. <clears throat> but he really needs to push back and destroy these board bases. I will win water in four minutes. <laughs> the Green, Green Navy is, is moving Green. sides. Green is coming for him. Can he's already you... got one dock completely full. Oh, the, the building's oh! coming up. Right. Oh, let's go. Come on, you got to get more, man. Oh, he did the war. He did. I think there's a card that he did, right? Or is there's a. There's some kind of big button for water. Uh, it's just. It pops out some taller canoes, I think. I don't think. I think it's like four or five of those. Okay, well, those are pricey. Yeah, they definitely are. Alright, here we go. War dance is on. This is an age four navy versus Imperial British ships. But he is winning. He is winning. He is clearing clearing this out. <clears throat> oh my goodness. 
Someone in the chat says blue will win now $75. <laughs> blue is the underdog story for earnings today. Uh, this is beautiful. All right, the Navy has... It, it has won it. Has won. What's going to happen now? There's a lot of outposts. There's out a lot here. of outposts. He just needs to land some units. Honestly, Aeronites? Aeronites, anyone? Oh, that's fascinating. Just drop a bunch of Aeronites right here. <clears throat> that, that'd be very really good. <laughs> oh, Micah, listen a bit. You fall asleep for a minute and then crap hits the fan. Yep, that's, that's FFA. Okay, blue is just instantly spamming out tons of Here they food. come. But oh can, does he have enough wood? I don't know. He needs to take down the docks, honestly. Taking down the outpost is not the way to go here. Yeah, those docks do need to go down. Yeah. Red is building a fleet himself, and it is pulling <clears throat> to the middle. Yeah, Red has spies. Oh, no. Now we have a 2v1 naval battle, ladies and gentlemen. And Red is winning on the land front as well. Um, oh, my goodness. That is... It turned upside Red down. Red has passed up green in score. Red has passed up the score. <clears throat> green no longer top dog here. Oh, this is so good. This is amazing. Hussar is landing. The galleons are producing them. Oh, man. Oh, absolute pinch. That is beautiful. It is incredible. Just incredible. Red's continuing to clear out the base in the south. Green is dead silent. That's because he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> he is, he's already uh, dead. Stable's coming up. He's going to try to defend on the island. More Hussar just being, being dropped right there. Eagle oh, the going down. Docks are going down. Eagles land. Yes. I I still can't believe he's H four. I still can't believe he's H four either. The respect is incredible. Either the respect or the ignorance is incredible. <laughs> <laughs> one of the two. We don't know which one. Uh, greens. Uh, this is his room. He's trying to rebuild a TC way down like south, but ain't no chance. No chance. Almost all the docks are down. We just gotta cut one more over here. No more no. docks from the main place, I don't think. Yeah, they, he still has all these trade posts up, so Green's getting lots of wood from those still, I think. All right, Hussars are pressing towards the, the blue base. Green's trying to, trying to end blue in some kind of fashion here. I'm desperate for it, actually. And the center is destroyed. Man, that was extremely quick. How fast that, that was insane. How fast that went down. That was quite insane. Wow. Can he defend against green though? Green does have basically 200 pop space for military and yeah. tons of resources. Yeah, that's a good point. Dragoons are pulling here from red. He's upset. The extreme walls are going up. 23,000 HP walls. <clears throat> dropping them everywhere. It's funny that when you spam Cav and you can't get into the base, then you get upset. <laughs> Ooh, shots Man, fired. Man, shots fired. Oh, that's beautiful. You love to see it. Wow. Cost you uh, twenty five dollars. No, 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 no. <laughs> uh, it's hilarious. That's hilarious. No, Green's been played great. Green's played great. Respect to the lad. That is good. He, he did play well. It just didn't work out for him here. Should have attacked you all here. Yes, you probably definitely should have. I want to see blue build in the center now. <laughs> or somewhere. 
Still, still just that that one tomahawk. Yeah. One tomahawk. I really want to see someone get him. <laughs> Man, what a game! What a finals! What else could you ask for today? I don't think you could ask for much been, more. Been pretty fabulous. I'm amazed at how good this uh, Aztec food economy is. He has one farm. He's been having had one farm this entire time. <laughs> I just summarizes the Aztec eco. Uh... But now, what does he do with his water? Arm? That is the question. Yeah. I mean, once Green's dead, surely I. I mean. Blue surely just quits then, right? I mean, I, I mean, you're yeah, that's a one v one for the the prize, the grand prize. I think you got to go for it. I mean, but come on, come on. I mean, what is he gonna do? Turtle, turtle, red to death. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kind of sad that uh, it appears Green doesn't have an advanced arsenal. At one point three against buildings for C is pretty nice. That's good. That's a good call. <clears throat> it is all out combat everywhere. Except on this trade post. It's still just a trade post. There's one yeah, there's one trade post left for green. I mean he has we know how much resources he has, so I'm a. I wish the green just has like random military units kind of spread out. I know. I feel like he could use that pop by the will. Yeah. Blue is fortifying the center island. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. Imagine town dance with. Oh, he doesn't have the extra range card, I don't think, for buildings. That would be insane. Yeah. The other thing is, too, is depending on where his dance is, it could definitely get sniped from a monitor ship, but. He doesn't uh, have the extra range on his so he, he can do that, but it's still crazy. I love these diverse armies. We have Musketeers, Huron, Longbows, Cherokee. Gotta love it. All right, Green's trying to build a new TC to the south. Look, Granny's gonna take center. He's desperate. <clears throat> Come on, use your logic here. I'm not building anything. <laughs> he has space. He literally has spies. Bro. <clears throat> now, now Red just wants those twenty-five bucks. Gr gr yeah, green. Yeah. Oh uh, yeah, green. Sorry. <clears throat> I love the fact that there's this this strong war hut, and it's got like nine thousand HP, and it does eighty-seven damage. <laughs> <laughs> it's, just, it's, it's just sitting there wiping this whole army, this whole like cab badge. <clears throat> That's pretty great. I'll delete it. He deleted it. Boom. Wow. He's 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 trying to figure out the odds though. <laughs> this is hilarious. Blue is extremely funny. It, it, blue is extremely funny. Not anymore. He deleted his docs. This is hilarious. And he's still age four. If we have an age four player that gets second place in the FFA tourney, I Literally don't even know what else. to say. Everyone else would have been age five. <laughs> <clears throat> uh. I, I, that's the most impressive part out of all this. Yes, it's been impressive to see him live. But the fact that he's just still age four is is the cherry on top. All right, the red army is mobilizing. Looks 
like he's gonna clear out green. <clears throat> and think how frustrating it should be if you have a whole cavalry army of 50 trying to siege one outpost and you just watch half your friends die. <laughs> <laughs> that is... That's a little bit depressing if you put it that, that way. Is, it is... just turns Age Empires upside down. From this amazing game to this horror game. I'm still confused as to why them walking around a pit of fire makes walls be stronger, but... Whatever. <laughs> Whatevs. Man. What a match. Dude, score is lower than it was, like, 15 <laughs> minutes ago, I think. When, can he go H5? Is that possible? Is it possible? I don't know. I, I just, I want to see him finish H4. I just want to see it. Man. All right, so it looks like Green is getting cleared out the south. He's got some random troops all around the map. Uh, one trade post left. Uh, he has this group of barracks and a stable on the east. <clears throat> Anything else? Blue. Uh, del <laughs> he's got a couple of single bills. This is the comment right here. Blue deleted his way to victory. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's it's fantastic. It's true. Uh, that's fantastic. Wall Red is walling in Green's Explorer. Can you imagine that in real life? They're just like, <laughs> yeah, you have that whole massive navy it took 30 years to build. Just get rid of it all and we'll we'll have peace with you. Oh, man. I feel like that's definitely didn't been done before. That has to have been done before. But hasn't everything been done before? Nothing new under the sun. All right. Uh, Manor is trying to be built. Like, yeah. Oh, go ahead. No, no, go ahead. I was just saying, Manor's in the middle of the forest. I don't know what villagers tasked to those, but they're planning on building them. The interest rate's pretty high right now, but they might get up in time. <clears throat> I just love how once this engagement begun, Green has just been dead silent. <laughs> oh, it's just hilarious to me. Sheep and Imperial Redcoat live in the south? The war sheep? With that 10 hit points. Oh no, here comes the army to take him out. <laughs> How did he get his explorer up? There's a musketeer there. Not anymore. Oh, oh, oh. He's got this one bill here. Where's that bill at? Uh, like straight on the far, the left side of the ocean, right there, chopping wood. Oh yes. <laughs> Oh, it's stable. Drop stable. I mean, but what's the point anymore? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm waiting for the red trade mono. Yeah, it's pretty viable right now. And he gets these other, this green trade post and these two free ones. I still don't understand why he hasn't destroyed that. Another All green you need one. Is five musketeers just right there on the green trade post. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, is I don't think Green's is Green gonna have population to build? Oh yeah, he's got to build houses. There you go. I was gonna say I don't think Green has any population to build any. Well, unless he had the hundred thing. Oh, that's a good point. Yeah, you're right. I very rarely get that because I'm like, only when I'm later in the game do I buy that. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of like uh, you know, if I if I have to use it, then I'm already too far gone. Kind of thing. <laughs> All right, I think Red is trying to wall off this Explorer. What do you think? <laughs> no, I don't. I think those are there for decorations. <laughs> it's a nice pattern. His musketeers are going in. 
One lives. He's up, but he can't get out. He's going <laughs> south. Wait, I don't. Oh, it's not built there. Oh, it's not built. <laughs> oh, it's. Oh. Oh. Where is oh, he going? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> the... <laughs> He's gotten out. Oh, we have another. Oh, and our division's coming in. <laughs> Come on, juke, 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 juke. Impaled with an axe. Oh, He's green. Oh, no, that base died. Oh, right. the arrow knights helped uh, red up here, seeds down green's barracks. All right, he's completely uh, redeploying on the west side again now. Manners oh. everywhere. Britain, <laughs> in a summary. I remember when I played the Age of Empires 3 demo, after I played Age of Empires 2 for a little bit, and I got a free villager when I built a house, and I was instantly like, this is the greatest game of all time. <laughs> <clears throat> He's green's desperate for those dollars now. I wouldn't trust anyone at this point. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like this is this is where it uh comes down to the wire. I wonder how many resources he has left. Let's see. How do, how do you see that? You go view post game, economy, and then unspent resource on the right side. He has 102,000 res still. Oh my. Red has a 150 though now. Yeah. <laughs> this is hilarious. Oh my goodness. I'm just annoyed that Red... that uh, I'm a little bit annoyed that Red hasn't just built the massive army of us to chase down these last builds. Yeah, that's kind of true. It's kind of like... It's, uh, he's got these stables here. He just needs to wipe out those builds. Yeah, Blue doesn't know where Green's at at all. I feel like Red hasn't used SR much. Not really. Up to you. <clears throat> I like how he's acting like it's going to matter. <clears throat> oh. There's the monitors. It's such... It's so... They're so good. They're a game changer. Honestly... Some games would never end if they weren't a thing. That's a complete fact. <laughs> Have you ever played Wars of Liberty? Uh, I tried it one time, but it messed up my game, so I had to completely delete my game and then reinstall it, so I haven't tried it since then. <laughs> that sounds like Wars of Liberty. Well, they, <laughs> they have a monitor ship that shoots even further. Oh, my. Because it's, whatever, the 18 or 1900s there. Uh, and there was, like, it basically shoots across the whole map. I have not played Wars of Liberty since then. Since I encountered that. Oh, and like a, it was on a pond in a small map. <laughs> it was the worst thing ever. <laughs> There's no chance. Uh, that's pretty fabulous, though. Alright, Red is deploying. He's using the Navy. Blue is also showing up. He's got a canoe. With the entire army on it. Oh, it died! <laughs> oh. oh. That's so sad. That's hilarious. All right, here comes green. I tried to deploy some units and they died. <laughs> green can have a massive army, though. He can. Yeah. No I'm still sad that there's a trade post down here. <laughs> There's a trade post in there. There's bills here and bills here. Man, that that navy uh, demolished that base. There's no, <laughs> there are no military buildings left. That's incredible. Wow. Blue, yeah, blue's still not imperial. Yeah. I like how he has two villagers on the island. 
He's just kind of ready. Man, hope everyone's been enjoying the action today. It's uh, it's been a final. That can be said. That has certainly been a final. Green desperately trying to make anything. Is blue gonna make if any? Go ahead. Sorry. I was gonna say. If you're green here. <laughs> uh huh. What do you do if you can push back against red? Like, well, he. I think he's gotta get some kind of eco up first. So maybe secure. Uh, I don't know, a side or something. But if you're not gonna go the eco route. I don't even know. Maybe I just raid, try to I don't know. I don't even know. I don't know where to start. Yes. The thing is is he either's got to take out proxy bases or he needs to take out his eco. I don't think Green is keen on finishing anytime soon. I feel like Red could squash him so easy here. He just hunted down these last few bills with, with the Hussar. Mm -hmm. I think that I think he could win then. Uh, well, he does have a state. Right? So can build out. No, Green doesn't have a state. Yeah, all he has to do is build these last few bills. Let's see uh, res count. So it's 88,000 resources. <laughs> okay, red is coming in here though. At least. Oh, the Hussars have arrived. <clears throat> oh, Eagle Runners have uh, arrived also. <laughs> Still age four. <laughs> it's still age four. Good for them. He's going for villager kills. That is that's pretty that's that's what Gred needs to be doing right now. Uh-huh. I don't think they realize how not low he is. I don't know, I'm amazed at how quickly eighty thousand is great. That's that's very true. Especially especially if he has a lot of that on food. But he is in Red's base. So yeah. Red, just, Red has so many resources. <clears throat> yeah, Red can just delete his right bills. Now, the way it is right now, Red can just... The more he loses, the more he can build. So. Pumas! I do like the Puma play here. Here they come. He does. He is trying to just chase down the bills. I wish he had the uprinch neck upgrade on 1.5 against bills. Mm. That would be pretty, pretty sweet. That's not the official name, but that's what I. Call I like it. that name. That's the accurate name. Can you imagine a new player? Why does this Aztec civilization have a Russian naming card? All <laughs> pro AOE three players. You will know in some time. <laughs> Uh, it's going Puma and Coyote is, is pretty fun. That's a fun combo. You just torch through people's bases and that's all you do. Alright, these villagers are dying. Uh, I'm assuming Estates is in play, so I might get a villager spawn here at some point, but... No, Green doesn't have Estates. Oh, know. he doesn't? That's a huge L. That was Red who had Estates. Oh, that's going to cost him. Where does he have more bills, though? No, that's it. They just died. So all he needs now is a couple arrow knives to see these down. That's it. I can't believe Blue still has this. Is still age four and has this little score. Uh, it's the mad. That's just a mad respect. Mad respect. What dance does he have going? It doesn't, it doesn't show. Yeah, it doesn't. I think it's uh, which one is that? One, it, one of them glitches and it doesn't show. 
Um, Probably like the clicker build speed. Yeah. Uh, like five biopasses, coyotes are coming out. I don't remember, but. Oh, there's the arrow knights. There we go. Green is raiding like crazy. <clears throat> yeah, at this point in red, I think you just delete your units and just match it with a huge I army. Oh no, there's Red's other factory. Where is it? It's right here, way down the, toward the bottom. Of oh yeah. It exists! I I Did he send that way late? <clears throat> Ooh, that might be a tactical play. That's, that might be. Wait till one's down because you know you're going to get attacked anyways, and then... I, ho I really hope that's on purpose. I wonder, yeah. It does look like... Green, green is now getting spotted, so. Blue's gotta be loving every second of this right now. Blue. To full advantage. That's so good. Yeah, these buildings are going down. He's on the retreat. He has. There's two buildings left. The Red Army has arrived. Oh my goodness. There are there are no more villagers on the map for uh, for green here. These longbows are just sitting here and just dealing so much damage. Sitting here in this little pocket. Oh, but the coyotes are here. Goodness gracious! <laughs> That's a lot of population. He must not. He's not rocking full pop. Villagers, there's no way. That's a lot. On blue? Yeah. I mean, that's uh, maybe that's right. Because Aeronites Knights are double like popping uh, Asian dynasties. Yeah. <laughs> Four cavalry run away just to tell the tale. Good stuff. <laughs> Wacky oh peanuts. Oh my, is he literally going to hide in the corner? Come on, green. Wow. Come on. He dropped one cav off right I there. I see it, yeah. That is such a... Uh, yeah, at this that's, point, that's a no bueno. That's no fun, man. I mean, maybe, maybe if he can go all the way around and get up his explorer. <laughs> And then need help. have it just die immediately no. by uh, outpost fire. I need wood. <clears throat> I think we got him. Give me cred. Street cred. <laughs> they can't see your chat. I need coin. That's funny. That was that is amazing. Why is he not imp? <laughs> this is... That's the best part. He's definitely gonna get second, it appears. Still trade post down south for green, but... He's too hus. Wait, I thought he had four hussars. Where's the other one? There's one way north. Oh, it's hiding up there. It might. You're abandoned. You abandoned your colony. What's covering it? <laughs> <clears throat> and he has resigned. Oh, GG. Wow. And then there were two. Well, one and a half. <laughs> <laughs> one and a half. What happens now? Are they? Do they go at each other? He's still age four. I mean, here come here come the ships, instantly getting built. Well, you have five minutes. <laughs> <clears throat> For what? To rebuild? I don't know. I mean, if I'm red, I'm getting every single trade post. I'm building. Building he everything. Finally destroy greens. <laughs> After he died. After he died. 
<laughs> oh, Blue's going for the full navy. We have like seven docks. And he's building some on the center island. Yes. All right, let's say we're gonna get a little bit of a showdown here. Okay, if he's giving him a bit to rebuild, I have to use the restroom. I'll be right back. That's a good call. Let's do that. Restroom break. BRB. All right, we're back. What happens now? <laughs> Two minutes. He's got a yes. strict timer on here. Hope everyone is enjoying the 2023 fifth annual free for all tourney finals it has been quite the contest today we've had everything you could want early attacks uh bitter hatred epic alliances and it's all stacking up to be this final 1v1 blue somehow has stayed alive this entire game it is age four still that alone it says everything you need to know yes um, man. Red here with the chance to just take it all. Where is the battle happening? <clears throat> There's, I think he said there, there was a minute, two minutes left or a minute left. Uh, Blue's on the retreat. Really wish it was age five. Oh. Oh, no. No. <laughs> What? <laughs> what? What? Oh. Bummer. Well. <clears throat> All right, hold on. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> I think uh, I'm kind of skeptical. Of what? <clears throat> Let's see what we want to do here. <clears throat> oh, man. All right, hold on. I'm going to put this on a break, and I'll figure this out here.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're back. Uh, dang, I'm so sad I don't get to see the stats of that game. That's really sad. Uh, red is the winner. So here's the ruling, <laughs> the official ruling here. I'm glad I wrote this stuff up because this actually hasn't happened before, I don't think, in this situation. Uh, so if it's un if it the game ends, they're supposed to play in a 1v1, except if it's an imminent victory. Uh, I think it's everyone would agree that red was pretty imminent on the victory. Uh, so we're going to give red the, the title there. Red wins the 2023 FA tourney. And uh, blue got second place. So that was pretty crazy. Let's go back. And we'll do player reveals now. This is going to be fascinating. Uh, before, I, before we go to that, uh, Claymore, any thoughts on what we just saw? Uh, I mean, that was one of the craziest games I've seen. Uh, I do think everyone played fairly well. The, the the massive ship pops by Blue were really fun to watch. Um, I think a couple of times, the only thing people really could have done better is actually purposefully not letting their eco get too high. Just a few times. But other than that, I really it was really enjoyable and everyone did really well. It was it was quite excellent. All right, uh, how should we go about this here? How what would be the best way to do it? Should I just make a document? Yeah, I think I'll do that. Let's make a new doc. And we're gonna go through and reveal the players uh, that have participated in the tournament this year. Uh, Spoiler, no one got any of the players right. <laughs> um, people were trying to guess in the matches who was who. And no one ever got it right. Alright, so 2023 player reveal. Let's boost this up here. Alright, so we'll go back with me. Uh, you can pull it up if you want. I don't know if you, you got to see all the the matches here. <clears throat> What's most important is blue won twenty five dollars. Blue gets seventy five dollars. Blue went big time. Yeah, Cayenne MVP as well. <clears throat> All right, game one. Yeah, he did really well. Yeah, Cayenne definitely with MVP. Unfortunately, he doesn't come away with any dollars though. Oof. Very rough. But but. I mean, Blue definitely did not see his Puma Cohen make score. For sure. Yeah. Hey, I... <laughs> that was just hilarious. All right, so game one was the... Um, which server was that? Oh, yeah, that was the Asia server. I think, right? Let me double check. Yes, okay. Game one was the Asian server. So we had Asian uh, time zone here. I Sorry, I should have done this in advance, so we're going to be revealing this now. Um, do you want me to screen share so you can see this? Uh, yes. That would probably be helpful. Um, we want... We'll give it a low frame rate, but the high quality. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Player reveals. Here we go. Game one was the Asia Pacific time. Uh, the winner in pink, I believe. Let me know. We'll see. Was it pink? Who won that? Yes, pink just dominated. What are we talking about? Can I do half? Yeah, I can kind of see it there. All right, let's see. I have the worst journaling <laughs> you've ever seen. I don't know. I've seen mine. Hold on. That's not right. I gotta find the right.
Sorry, hold on. Hold on. Okay, maybe it's a different one. Uh, teal was... Oh, here we go. Yes, okay. So the winner of game one was pink. Pink was Jaeger Shear. A. He advanced the finals. He was teal today. Oh. The Jaeger Shear was teal. Man, GG to him. That was really well done. Okay. Um, I'll put the other players out here too. Since we're at it, the reason I have I have his name on here is each year because that's his Discord. Uh, let's see. I'll go back. I'll go back. Let me do the winners and then we'll go back and do this. All right. So game two, we'll do one at a time here. Here they are. <clears throat> we had. I don't remember who won this. Was it? I think it was purple? teal. Teal. I thought so. Aztec. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. I should have organized this so much better. All right, two. Uh. He had the insane walls. <laughs> yeah. No, I don't think he he won. Purple won, didn't he? Yeah, purple won. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, purple was uh, Willy Wag. Willy Wag Tails returned for another finalist appearance. Uh, and today he was. Let me double check. I think he was yellow. Yeah, musket enjoyer. He was yellow today in the finals. Uh, no one, no one else advanced for that. Uh, I know off the top of my head that uh, Teal was Torian Karkon playing with the mighty Aztecs as he does. Oh, that makes sense. Teal. Um, also, I know these off the top of my head a little more. Uh, green was. I or L I L D N. I don't know who this person is. This is the first time I've seen them. Uh, they were green and they advanced onto the finals for their performance, and they were also green today. So yeah, green really from that game was green today. Hey, I called it. I called <laughs> it. So that counts. Uh, China in this one, <laughs> yellow was Danzel ninety two, who got cav rushed. Man, that was rough. Um, who else was here? <clears throat> and then the last one, uh, Larac was playing, what was that, blue? All right. That's all that game. Okay, I know that one off the top of my head. We'll have to go back to game one here in a little bit. I know that one off the top of my head a little more. All right. How's the chat doing? <clears throat> we need to know who's blue. <laughs> We're getting there. We're getting there. All right, next game. Game three. Good idea. Ah, this was the spicy one. <laughs> wait, was it, this the bribing one? This this was not... Sorry. Oh, wait, was this the bribe one? I don't think so, was it? No, no, that was the, that's the fourth one. All right, this is fascinating, okay? this is This is fascinating. So the winner of this one was uh llama op who is playing as fresh fish so fresh fish won this one and fresh fish was also blue today and aztec oh nice that is good so he that's him today and then red in this game was King Shembu, who also advanced to the finals because of his performance, and he was red today. He won the finals today. 
And so they literally faced each other again, <laughs> unknowingly, <laughs> in this finals mashup. So that is hilarious. Uh, he played really well as well. Yeah. Blue, blue. I think I gotta put most entertaining on blue though. Most entertaining on blue. <laughs> That's <laughs> certainly up there. Uh, that is for sure. Uh, let me see other players here. Um, Lopardo was third amendment. Who is green? He died. He died immediately. That was sad. He lost connection. Uh, Janvik was musket enjoyer. Who is yellow. The other Aztec player. Uh, Danny 2023 was Ottoman, teal, deck, and elephant. Um, is that it, or is there one more? Oh, purple. <clears throat> ah, wait, was that purple? Mom Spaghetti. Where does this account? <clears throat> Wait. Oh, Laz. There we go. I had it. Yeah, he changed. Okay. Laz was purple with ports. All right. Is that right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. There's one more. We got blue. Oh, Santa Pug. Oh, yeah. Uh, Lolly Verbice <laughs> was the one who got rushed hard. All right, those are players from game three. We're getting it, we're getting it. Game four. Any surprises so far? Or does it all seem, seem like it was the fine? All right, who are the players that are bribing? <laughs> There's the laughing. <clears throat> Or did I write this one down? Scrubs McGrubs was the winner of this one. He made it to hit the finals once again. He was red. Santa Pug. And he was orange today. So Scrubs McGrubs did make it to the finals for another appearance. Uh, but he fell short. Unfortunately. So he was red in game four, orange in finals. He was the first one out. Uh, where's green? Third. All right, other players. Uh, Jester Mar was Musketeer Enjoyer. Which was pink. Who else we got? <clears throat> Vu Vu Cyboat. There's a sailboat. Uh, was Third Amendment. Whoa. Who was orange? Gonna condense it here. Um, anyone else? Yes. Tugboat Ronin was Deccan Elephant. Who was purple? Um, was this the one? Who else we got here? <laughs> Forbidden Soul. My boy. Your boy. I uh, believe it was Mom's Spaghetti. Was that the right one? Yeah, blue. All right, so that was that game. Uh, so we got to go back to game one. <clears throat> All right, 
this was the one that Jaeger was in. Okay, yes. <laughs> All right, Dan the Man. Everyone wants to know uh, Dan the Man. I'm sure. The two-time finalist was unable to get another finals in. <clears throat> um, which one did I have on here? I think it was orange. Yeah. He was orange. Played pretty well in that one. Alraji. I see him on stream sometimes. He was teal. Um, Mr. Object Oriented was Brits. I think it was yellow. All right. Yeah, must your enjoyer. Yellow. And then. Oh wait, I think I'm missing missing one here. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Tice, our uh, nutty elf, uh, was I think green, right? Mom spaghetti. No. Oh yeah, sorry, I got these confused. Hold on. Uh, he was. Tice, and then he was green. All right, is that it? I think there's one more. Shawshank, can't forget about you, sir. Which one is a left here? Purple. Uh, third Amendment. All right, that is it. Okay, so that is it. I hope that's all right. Uh, that looks correct. So we, for our finals today, we had an excellent showdown. Let's just make this a little smaller. We had Jaeger cheer as teal. Uh, Willy Wag as yellow. LDN as green, fresh fish as blue, and King Shambu as red. King Shambu is your 2023 attorney winner. Scrubs McGrubs was orange. That is it, ladies and gentlemen. I uh, hope you enjoyed the finals. Claymore, any other thoughts from, uh, I don't know, the player names or the match? Well, I, I'm i not surprised that King Shampoo was red. Just putting that out there. Because <laughs> he played Brits in both games and played red. <laughs> I'm not surprised. And his play style. Was, was Cyan. Uh uh those those are i the other people i don't know as well but them too definitely um played well and i now looking back i can kind of recognize it but that was amazing all right well congratulations king shembu your first uh ffa tourney win fresh fish with a nice second place performance ldn played really well both games with the no wall strategy Gotta absolutely love that. Willy Wags came back with another finals performance, grabbing fourth place. Jaeger Cheer played extensively well in this tournament with the MVP award. We gotta get him some kind of something for the award. We gotta figure that out. And uh, Scrubs with Grubs making our finals appearance. So that is it. The 2023 FFA tourney has concluded. Hope you guys all enjoyed, and we will see you all on the next stream. Take care.